Hey there, everybody. How's it going today? Ian back here with the Entertainment Examiner. Hey, I'm going to be, be uh, trying out some classic movie rev uh, uh, reviews for you guys on this channel. Um, I'm going to be doing two, two movies from one of my all-time favorite people, the late great uh, Robin Williams. Um, I've loved Robin Williams since, since I was little. Um, I miss him very, very much. Um, I got to see him do stand-up comedy in 2007. It was probably one of the funniest things I've ever seen, so... Rest in peace, Mr. Williams. Um, I'm going to be talking about two of his movies. First one is Good Morning Vietnam. This finally came out on Blu-ray about a year or so ago. Um, this has some good special features on it, directed by Barry Levinson, who would go on to direct Rain Man the next year and be not and win the Oscar for it. Not just be nominated, but win. Uh, this was Ro Robin Williams' first Oscar nomination. My cat's coming to say hi. Um, he... Um, Hold on. Okay, sorry about that. Um, he plays Adrian Cronauer, a disc jockey during the uh, Vietnam War, a as he entertains the troops on the radio, in which a lot of um, that does not go over well with the high up brass in the military. They don't like his style and brand of humor. Um, there's also a deeper story with a young man that he befriends in Vietnam during this time as well. Uh, this is based on an actual person, but um, most of it is just Robin Williams doing what he does best in, in, in improvising. Uh, Forrest Whitaker, he is in this too. Um, I, the, the scenes between them are very genuine. In the radio station, you can tell Robin probably uh, Im improvised most of this. And it comes off just just um, um, hilariously well. Um, and um, I've always lo loved this movie. This is just a one disc edition, just a single disc. Um, but definitely pick this up if you do not have this in your collection. I, I love Good Morning Vietnam. T Time Magazine on the back says the best military comedy since MASH. Probably so. Um, so yeah, I've always loved this movie. Um, just it's really funny, great humor, and a great 60s soundtrack too. If, if you like uh, 60s music, definitely check this one out. The next one is another good movie, Goodwill Hunting. Um, I've always loved this movie too. I saw this in theaters when it came out in 1997, up for a lot of Oscars. R Robin Williams finally won his Oscar for Best Supporting Actor for this movie. Of course, uh, it stars Ben Affleck and Matt Damon in one of their first things they've ever did they wrote this together won the oscar for writing matt damon plays will hunting a janitor at a university who um everyone realizes is a is a genius he solves this uh math uh puzzle that the uh, uh, professor played by stellan skarsgård puts on the chalkboard that's up here in this photo and but he has a lot of personal issues too he gets in trouble all the time and he goes to see a, a psychiatrist played by Robin Williams. Ben Affleck is his be best friend in this movie. Um, Minnie Driver is his love interest, who, who also got an Oscar nomination. Um, there's some really good special features on this, just kind of a blank, well, not blank Blu-ray, but just the cover art. This is, this is the 15th anniversary edition. Um, it's got a four-part retrospective on the making of uh, Elliot Smith's um, music video, the late Elliot Smith for Miss Misery, which was also nominated for an Oscar, uh, audio commentary by the director, Gus Van Sant, and Damon and Affleck. Um, they do a, uh, a, a remembrance, too, from Matt Damon. And I'm sure that they talk about Robin Williams in this, too. So I love this movie. This is like one of my top three films of 1997 when it came out. I still think this is a great movie. That scene of them on the bench together when Williams is talking to him is just fantastic. And it shows both of these, along with other movies, but both of these, I think, especially show what a great actor Williams was and what a great talent we lost, not just as a stellar comedian, but also as a stellar actor. He's always been one of my favorites. And um, I just thought I would share a reflection of these movies with you today in this classic movie review series I'm going to be doing. I got lots more for this channel for you guys. Sorry it's been so long since I've had a video posted. Um, got some more unboxings coming up. Um, I'm also might be trying to vlog for the first time a trip I'll be taking next month. So we'll see if that works out. So, yeah, if you've never seen the, these movies or if you love these movies, Good Morning Vietnam, Goodwill Hunting, check them out. 
Uh, let me know down in the comments which of these movies you like better or which is your favorite. Um, I would love to hear from you. And like, comment, su and subscribe to my page, Entertainment Examiner, and leave me a comment so you guys, um, or leave me a, I've done this so long, well, leave me a comment, but also ring the bell for notifications uh, so you guys know when I post new videos, and I, I will definitely try to get more videos out to you guys soon, so. Okay, that's all I got for this video, so th thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. You made an appearance in...